Hi, Namaste everyone. Today in this video, I am going to teach you how to submit the assignment for the course Deep Learning, Neural Networks and Deep Learning, the course offered by Coursera. I got a lots of request to make video on it and teach how to solve the assignment. For quiz you all are very comfortable. I am hopeful and I know well. Even the programming you know well but as you are going to work very fast on Jupyter, most of you are working at very first on Jupyter so you are in dilemma and confusion that what to do and where to do how to do so you are finally unable to reach at the destination means you are unable to complete the assignment and without completing the assignment you are not going to get any certificate Moreover, this deep learning is the trending topic, so you want certificate on it. So finally, I decided to make one video, short video on it and guide you the way how to do it. So let me show you, I have already done and then I will teach you how to do it. So you will get the confident otherwise you will tell that uh, you have itself not done and you are telling us. So that is the reason I completed at first you can see we have completed I completed today only in morning and here you can see my certificate. So you can see completed and this is my certificate already I have completed and how again I am showing you congratulations you have successfully completed and coming to the programming is from week 2 you can see here this is week 2 programming and graded 100% means I have met all the requirement and I have done it successfully so you may again if I do here you may have doubt you may telling that I am just doing here and my process is right or not or I have the earlier score so you may have the confusion so I plan to do it the fresh means so where I have not done I will start from very beginning so now I am going to demonstrate here so most of I know most of you are stuck here itself because you are unable to complete the program even you can see my friends have completed all the quiz but he has even stuck at the programming portion so I am going to just describe single single program I will do and I will tell you the process to complete it practically so please watch this entire video without a skip so you will not miss and you will able to do it in case of any error and any difficulty then please contact me or comment me or whatsapp me I will definitely will be there to help you out but please you try to do yourself only don't ask me to complete for your behalf so I am not going to that way helping you I will help you if you do yourself generally so now you can see here programming the score is 0 I can again refresh it and show you this is 0 only so let me refresh it again and show you for your clarity beam of your clarity so you can see here this is 0 only now I will go and open in new tab so in new tab I am opening and I will first tell you what are the environment you have to work and how to work then I will do so you will overcome from all your limitation and 
the information in which you are lacking. So here programming some frequent question is there. So you follow the instruction the same way you read the instruction. If you read the instruction carefully, that everything is mentioned very clearly. You can do the thing very precisely. So here we are going to work on Jupyter Notebook. And what is Jupyter Notebook? So you can read here what is Jupyter Notebook. Every details is there. And what are the editor you are going to get? Coursera half editor you will get. And this is the online you can get here. You can open. You can and for submission you can click here submit assignment. So this type of console you are going to get it and you have to complete. So you can see here the every details and read out. Now coming to the notebook basically. So this is the basic notebook with numpy. So this is as you can see here, this is this is the optional. Optional even without doing this assignment, you can secure the certificate. So I am not going to solve the optional. The optional is a bit easy. So I am directly going to the graded assignment that is programming, which is not optional. So I will solve this. Right. So here uh, I am going to my submission here. So you can see here there is already he has done some submission on those date and you can see here there is grading fail, grading fail, grading fail means there is error, there is zero zero score you can see. You can see all those, the, those all have the zero score only. So you can see here none of the submission is correct. Now I am going to do it. So how to do it? Let me complete it and tell you everything. So now the notebook, Jupyter notebook is opening and here you can see this is a logistic regression with a neural network mindset. So this is working here, this programming and open notebook. So I am going to open the notebook. So you be sure that uh, you have logged in your account, Gmail account with same browser and as well as the Coursera so you can easily assess these third party tools so it is opening and I have already done with code so I will not take long time I will just copy and paste the code and complete it as soon as possible so I can save your time So we have to run the code and to run the code you have to press shift and enter. So I am running the code and see here I am running the code. This is the cat I got and this is the code what he has done, my friend has done. But here you can see the expected result is this. So I have to go for that code, the matching code. So I am going to complete that code. Here even you can see none, none it is showing and this other unnecessary thing going on. So let me go there and fix it. So I will go and test the thing, the code, okay, so I will copy the code and test there, ok, 
Okay. And I will run the code. Here I am getting some your syntax error. You can find here the syntax error line number two. Yes. Here is the error I am getting and even I will run. So you can say here the expected output and my output is the same. Now I will go here and on this code too. So here you can see here some error is there because I have not modified any code here. It is writing a start code here. So here I have to write something. So what I have to write, I have already completed. So I will just post that code. So for reshape, I have to those all codes are very interlinked code. So once you do one mistake, then you are not going to exactly getting the result what you are expecting. So this is the code I done and again I will run this. So it is not showing any error you can see now and I will go go down go down and now sigmoid I am going to do this code. So for sigmoid I also have the code. I have already so saved those all code while I was doing it. So I have code and I hope you also know how to write the code. So now then done. So you can see here my expected and the given result. So here I am some something I have to manage here. You can check out. So no issue, no issue. Okay, this is the done. So now I will go and submit. So now I am going to submit the assignment. So first program I have done. So my score must be 10 when I will check it. So this is the entire process I have told you. And please follow the same pattern. So you can complete it and due to network some network problem I am taking a long bit time to submit it. Okay, okay, okay. Let me check you in the page here. You can see here there is nothing showing. I will even refresh this after submission. I have done one problem submission. So I will refresh it and I will show you what is my score or I have done any mistake. So you can see. So you can see I have got here 10 score. So I did the sigmoid, sigmoid problem. So you can see here in sigmoid problem I get 10 out of 10. So this is the way you can submit and for remaining things you keep on doing and you submit you will get the score. And to pass this assignment, at least you have to score 70 marks out of 100. You have to earn that score. So please do it. And in case of any doubt, please do comment. I will definitely help you out. Thanks again for watching this video. And if you found my video is uh, important and helpful to you then please subscribe the channel and click on bell so you will get notification about this type of educational video and the practical video so thanks again for everything and watching the video and please do stay at home and stay safe thanks again